Hi guys, this is Tash, the Starcross Stitcher. Today is Thursday Mania the 11th. And tonight, I'm coming to you at the end of the night. I couldn't film earlier because I was a little busy and then my phone ran out of batteries and blah blah blah. Um, the one I'm working on today is the Beautiful Sea Stitch Along by The Ship's Manor. This was the stitch along that started um, either late in 2016 or early in 2017. It's now finished. There are 16 parts and what you can see here is basically the first four parts. So that's like the top quarter of the design is about here. Um, so what I've worked on tonight is basically this orange part in the corner. I did the lighthouse, the bubble. I did a few of these little single stitches that you see. And then I came and worked a little bit on this medallion. And for now I'm going to have to call it quits for the night because it's getting late. Um, you know, oh look how pretty the colours are, right? Lovely, aren't they? I've never used um, the Ship's Manor threads before. I'd actually never heard of the Ship's Manor until I saw this showing up in on Stitch Mania and in the Stitch Mania group. Um, but I do really love it. I was sort of having mixed feelings about it when I picked this up tonight. Um, in Blitz Stitch's last video, Brian talked about um, that he was going to put his away and potentially call it a UFO. Um, because he didn't like the fabric it was stitched on, and his fabric is very similar to mine. Um, and I'm not 100% happy with the fabric I chose because, you know, I can see that colors really blend in, especially around the, um, the lighthouse. It's not perfect, but when I pulled it out again tonight, you know, I was thinking about it, and I had actually in my head decided that, yep, it was probably going to be a UFO for me as well. Um, but I pulled it out tonight and I actually like it all over again. The colours are really different to what I usually stitch with. You know, I don't get these bright turquoises and oranges very much in my stitching. Um, and I do think that when it's done, it's going to be pretty. And there isn't so much work in it. So, yep, I will keep going with this. This should be something I should finish this year because the parts are quite small. I'm more than 25% done now. Probably 30% done. Um, I need to order more of this dark blue thread. Yes, remind me to do that. Order more Bonnie Blue. Bonnie's Blue, it's called. Um, okay, so that's it for tonight. I have a new start tomorrow, which I'm very excited about. A big one. Um, I also have a new start on Sunday, which is another big one. Um, I love new starts. Mania is going well for me. I think it's kind of crazy working on a new thing every day. You don't really get to get stuck into it, but it is interesting um, and it's a good experience. It's, you know, pulling out all of your whips, the ones that you wouldn't usually have looked at at this, or, you know, not for maybe months down the line. Um, it's good to pull them out and remind yourself of what you've got. Um, yeah, I feel like some of the whips I've pulled out, I actually could work on those and wouldn't need new starts. But I'm committed to the, <laughs> to the mania starts and they're going to be great fun. All right, guys, that's it for me. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.